guys. So today is gonna be a video. So I'll give you honest with you guys. I've really been hating this on this game for a while. You guys probably heard it heard it in my videos. I'm not really into this game as much as I used to be. It's just really depressing. So, here's a story of why I really... Well, no, no let's not do it like that. How about, how about like this? This game... I'm going to just give you guys my thoughts, my personal thoughts on this game, and why I hate it first, and then I'm going to finish it off like it, because, you know, first off, the bad. So, my personal thoughts on this game is... I hate it, honestly, like, this game just makes zero sense to me, it's not realistic, but yeah, it's Fortnite, you know what I'm saying, it's, it's a, a game where everyone builds, everyone gets together, kill each other, they're so excited to kill each other, yeah, yeah, okay, that's cool, but, um, there's more to the game, I thought, when I first played this game, I was really not sure what to do in this game, it was kind of fun. At first, this game just like it was the best thing. It was goofy. It was fun. It was nice to play with your friends and with stuff. But now the game just fell apart. Yeah, it sounds a little dramatic. Yes, I know, but like the game just fell, which I really, really hate. I can't I can't find a joy into this game anymore. Yes, there's battle passes and stuff, but at, after a while that stuff starts to get a little stressful and boring. I need something more to like satisfy my hunger. There hasn't been a lot of games, so this game has been kinda my go to for us, to be honest with you. And there's not a whole lot that I really want in this game. At first I really did not care about this game season one i just chilling and having a great time with my friends season two chilling having a great time with my friends season three that's when everyone started taking it seriously so i was like okay well i'll take it seriously too totally incapable of doing that totally incapable of doing that i was like y'all take this game i told my friends i was like you guys take this game way too seriously so I quit. I quit Fortnite for the equivalent of three months. I was fine. I was absolutely fine with it. Because I wasn't really into the game. And then I came I came back to Fortnite at the end of season four. And I started getting into it. I got the battle pass and that that's when my Fortnite fever, or I rather say idiot disease began. So Basically, um, I became a little obsessed with this game, and if you guys probably have seen, I have issues, and with this, with this game now. So whenever I'm playing with people, I take this game really seriously. So, mm, that's about it. Season five, Stern starting to get stale but I'm still trying to hold on for what I have left starting to hold on for what I basically had left in this game season 5 when I saw like a bunch of new characters new characters and skins is what brings me to this game that's what brings me into this and if there's no skins none of that stuff this game to me is basically pointless Sorry to say that, but this game without the battle pass is very, very pointless. So, and then season six now, here we are. Uh, season six is when I decided to make my YouTube ch channel and start making Fortnite videos. Should have done it a long time ago, the moment I got PS4. I was starting to get used to everything. I was trying to try to settle in. Set on the PS4, cause I was new from Xbox, didn't know what was going on, didn't know what to do with my life, and I still don't, but like, this game is all I kind of have now. 
And the fact that it's like this now, and it's not the same back in like season three and four, the fact that it like it's changed, it's really not that fun. I can't take it. Yeah, I probably I probably sound like a motor, I probably sound like a whiner, but like I have my reasons. I have my reasons. I have my reasons. So basically, um basically what I meant was See that right there? Fortnite, I mean Epic decides to add a little feature to the game called damage drop off. Damage drop off is actually a way to keep the game a little stable when you're shooting so far away and it does less damage. Now, I can agree with this. I honestly, I probably can't agree with this, but like, shotguns though, you put damage drop off on shotguns. So like now, they're ineffective. They're defective. And honestly, I'm starting to question why shotguns are even in this game. making me starting to question what is the purpose of shotguns if they just don't do a lot of damage whenever you guys see like 8 7 13 damage I can't tell you how angry that makes me that makes me just wanna just, just throw my controller off so. You just want to control my controller, honestly. So, yeah. I just had higher hopes. The fact that this game is now like this is upsetting the fact that the game is falling apart just not the same no more it's upsetting because like I really enjoyed this game shock and see whoa damage a bloom is too intense people double barrel too strong SMG is overused man this isn't the fortnite that I used to know isn't the Fortnite that I'm used to. I'm used to the old Fortnite to where we were able to run double pump, we were able to just make all of these new ideas and make something good out of it. Every time we come up with a new idea, it's like Epic just takes it and puts it in a box. And that box is to make it depressed, low, and increase its self-esteem. Double pump, they took it, and they just broke it. So now we can't even run double pump anymore. SMGs, they just buffed the hell out of that. So, yeah. But, I feel that Epic will soon realize that they made many mistakes, probably too many mistakes, and they'll fix it. And when they do fix it, things will be better. But until then, this game's awful. It's really awful. Now, now that we got that out of the way, we're gonna go on to better ideas and better thought process. We're gonna go to a, a better and more positive thought of why I really started to get into this game. This game brought me some promises. This game brought me many things things that I would the things that I was shown oops the things that I was shown show me that this game has potential it has promise and I could probably find a lot of joy in it don't pay attention to me on the ground don't pay attention to that that's normal that's part of the game 
I can't get mad at that. I'm mad that I fell for it, though. I didn't even get hit. That's the upsetting part. Anyway, this game brings a lot of teamwork out in a lot of places that you never really reach for. Let's say game of Destiny. Shout out Destiny. I really like that game. I really miss the game and I want to go back to it. I feel like I just can't. So sorry about that. But anyway, the point being, this game shown a lot of things between me and my friends. We enjoyed the game. We made plans. We learned how to work together better. Almost just as good as we did back in Destiny. And that, I find that really, really cool. Because, like, you don't see a lot of games that require teamwork in them, honestly. Except for 2K, but, like, I'm not a big fan of 2K no more. I'm not a fan of Anyway, speaking of which... Trying to be positive here, but that really upset me. Anyway, we're from there. this game can become better, or I don't know. Well, maybe it'll get better. I don't know. But I just want to say, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you.